Are you tired of Fortnite lagging and dropping FPS while gaming? Well, in this video, I'll show you how to unlock potato graphics in Fortnite for any GPU. These special settings will give you maximum FPS, fix stuttering, and even improve ground textures so you can play smoother gameplay even low-end PC. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Gear Up Booster is a great tool that helps reduce your ping while playing games, and it works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it safely from the official website using the link in the description, and enjoy with lower ping. Step 1. Optimize Windows for best performance for Fortnite. To make Fortnite run better, we need to make Windows faster by turning off some extra visual effects that make your PC look nice but slow it down. Start by clicking on the Windows search bar and typing. Adjust the appearance and performance of Windows click on the result that shows up. A window will open called Performance Options. Inside this window, select Adjust for Best Performance. This will turn off all the extra effects so your PC can run Fortnite faster. But if you want your computer to still look a bit nicer, you can turn two settings back on. Smooth edges of screen fonts. This makes text easier to read. Show thumbnails instead of icons. This lets you see small previews of images and videos instead of plain icons. After you choose your settings, click Apply to save them. Now go to the Advanced tab in the same window. Under Processor Scheduling, select Adjust for Best Performance of Programs. This gives more CPU power to Fortnite and other apps instead of background tasks. Click OK to save and close everything. Step 2. Making your CPU work better by unparking CPU cores for Fortnite. You can download and access all the files in one place from my Discord server. I'll also provide the links in the description. Your CPU has multiple cores, but sometimes Windows parks or turns off some of these cores to save power. This can slow down your PC, especially while gaming. To fix this, you need to unpark all your CPU cores using a tool. After the installation is done, right-click on the program icon and choose Run as administrator so that it can have full access to your system. When the program opens, it will show you which CPU cores are parked, disabled, and which ones are active, working. To activate all the parked CPU cores, simply click on the button that says Unpark inside the program. This will enable all CPU cores, and your processor will now run with its full power. Gear Up Booster is a great tool that helps reduce your ping while playing games, and it works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it safely from the official website using the link in the description, and enjoy with lower ping. Step 3. Fortnite Potato Gra Graphics Settings for AMD and NVIDIA GPUs. You can download and access all the files in one place from my Discord server. I'll also provide the links in the description. To make Fortnite run better on low-end PCs, you will need to use special graphics settings depending on the graphics card GPU you have. If your computer has an NVIDIA GPU, go to your desktop and open the folder called NVIDIA Potato Graphics. Inside that folder, you will find two files. One file is named Fortnite Potato Graphics Settings. The other file is called NVIDIA Profile. Inspector double-click on NVIDIA Profile Inspector to open it. If a message shows up asking for permission, click Yes to allow it. When it opens, go to the Profile section at the top. In the drop-down menu, find and select Fortnite. Now you will see all the Fortnite settings, including where the game is installed on your computer. Click on Import Profile, then go back to the NVIDIA Potato Graphics folder and choose the file named Fortnite Potato Gra Graphics Settings. Click Open to load the new settings, then click on Apply Changes to save them. If you ever want to go back to the original settings, you can click on Restore Current Profile to NVIDIA Default. If your computer uses an AMD or Intel GPU, go to your desktop and open the folder called AMD Graphics. Inside that folder, find the file named GameUserSettings.eni. Right-click on it and choose Copy. Now press Windows plus R on your keyboard, type percent local app data percent and press Enter. Go to the following folder path, Fortnite Game, Saved Config, Windows Client. Inside the Windows Client folder, right-click and choose Paste and then click. Replace the file in the destination. This file has special ultra-low graphics settings that turn off heavy effects like shadows and grass. Step 4. Optimizing System Memory Using ISLC Program for Fortnite You can download and access all the files in one place from my Discord server. I'll also provide the links in the description. In this step, we will improve how your RAM memory works by using a program called ISLC, Intelligent Standby List Cleaner. First, open the ISLC program. At the top of the window, you will see how much total RAM your system has. Now look at your total memory. You need to type half of that amount in the standby list section. For example, if it shows 32,000 megabytes, type in 16,000. If it shows 16,000 megabytes, type in 8,000. Next, check the box for Start ISLC Minimized and also check Launch ISLC on User Logon so that the program starts automatically in the background every time you boot your PC. Now, look to the right side and check the box for Enable Custom Timer Resolution. Below that, type 0.50 in the box. Leave the ISLC polling rate at 1000 unless you have a very slow or old computer. 
If your PC is very slow, then change the polling rate to 1000 instead. After finishing all the settings, click Stop, then click Start, and finally click Purge Standby List. This will clear unnecessary memory usage and make your RAM perform faster. Gear Up Booster is a great tool that helps reduce your ping while playing games, and it works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it safely from the official website using the link in the description, and enjoy with lower ping. Step 5. Reduce keyboard input lag using Filter Keys Setter for Fortnite. You can download and access all the files in one place from my Discord server. I'll also provide the links in the description. In this step, I'll help you make your keyboard respond much faster using a small tool called Filter Keys Setter. First, open the Filter Keys Setter program. You will see three important settings to change. Set Ignore Under to 0 milliseconds. This removes any delay before your keystroke is detected. Set Repeat Delay to 130 milliseconds. This controls how fast a key repeats when you hold it down. Set Repeat Rate to 10 milliseconds. This allows faster repeated key presses when a key is held. After setting those values, check the small box on the right to enable the settings. Then click OK to save and apply everything. Step 6. Optimizing Windows using the Ultimate Power Plan for Fortnite. You can download and access all the files in one place from my Discord server. I'll also provide the links in the description. To get the best performance from your PC, you need to make sure it is using the Ultimate Performance Power Plan. Go to the Windows search bar and type Power, then click on Change Power Plan when it appears. If your power plan is set to balanced, that's not good for gaming because it lowers CPU performance to save energy. You need to switch your power plan to high performance, or even better, to ultimate performance. To turn on ultimate performance mode, go to your FPS Boost Pack folder and run the file called Ultimate Performance Command as administrator. After running it, a message will pop up saying that ultimate performance mode has been enabled. Now go back to your power plan settings and select ultimate performance from the list of available power plans. This will keep your CPU running at its highest level. Step 7. Optimizing Windows using the Storage Sense settings for Fortnite. Open settings on your PC, then type Storage Sense in the search bar at the top. Click on Storage Sense and turn the switch on to enable it. Storage Sense automatically deletes temporary files and other junk that can slow down your system. Next, click on Configure Cleanup Schedules to change how often it runs. Set it to run cleanup every day and set it to delete files in the recycle bin after 14 days. This will keep your system clean, free up space, and make your PC faster for Fortnite and other games. Once you've done this, click Run Storage Sense now to start the cleanup right away. If this full Fortnite optimization guide helped you, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more guides about Fortnite and PC performance boosts. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.